For the first time in 24 years, a four-time undisputed heavyweight champion has been crowned and it's Oleksandr Usyk. Since his loss to the Ukrainian, it appears as though Tyson Fury has just officially retired from boxing for good. Does this mean there's no rematch? And who will Oleksandr Usyk fight next? Be sure to stick around till the end of the video for the full details. I haven't got the decision. I'm not going to cry about it. We'll read through. I'll have another day. Go on, speak to the wife and kids. And we'll see. I'll see what I want to do. You know, I ain't boxing here because I don't know what I'm I box it because I love it. Do you understand? I'm 36 in a few months. I've been boxing since I've been a child. So it is what it is. Where does it all end? Do you have a hundred fights and brain damage in a wheelchair? I'm not sure. But the one thing is, all the time I'm still loving the game, and I was having fun in there, I was really enjoying myself, then I'll continue to do it. And when I can't do that anymore, I'll pack it up. Usyk took away the British fighter's WBC title and added it to his WBA, IBF and WBO titles after forcing Fury topple against the ropes for a standing count that ended in triumph in Saudi Arabia, with scoring of 115 to 112, 113 to 114 and 114 to 113. However, Fury thought he had done enough to merit the victory and asserted that the Ukrainian had benefited from international sympathy for his ravaged nation. I believe I won that fight, Fury said. I believe he won a few of the rounds, but I won the majority of them, and I believe it was one of those what can you do, one of them, decisions in boxing. We both put on a good fight, best we can do. But make no mistake, I won that fight in my opinion and I'll be back, I've got a rematch clause. Before the year ends, promoter Frank Warren assured fans that Fury would face Usyk again. It's what Tyson wants, the clause in the contract says immediate rematch, Warren said. Yeah, of course, I am ready for rematch, said the Ukrainian when asked for his immediate reaction. But it appears as though a lot of fans believe this is the end of the road for Tyson and he will retire and leave boxing for good. Tyson Fury just needs to retire. Tyson Fury will most probably retire after this. Lineal champ talks over, not undefeated, first loss woes, stressed and unhappy. What a career Tyson Fury had, beat some of the greats, been a fan of him for many years. Have the rematch, take your payday and retire, you've done it all. Happy New Year and happy retirement Gypsy King. Be sure to subscribe to the channel and turn on the post notification bell. By doing this, you'll never miss out on any future videos from the combat sports world. Usyk then thanked his late father by saying, I feel good, to Sky Sports. I love you. Many people prayed for me. I'm very happy. My people will be very happy, I think. It's a big win. Not only for me, it's a big win for my country. For soldiers who now defend my country. I think my father now is watching over me and is very happy. Dad, I love you. I can. You told me I can. Nine months I work. Uh, missed. missed. I missed uh, Happy New Year. I missed birthday my son. I missed uh, birthday my son too. I missed birthday my daughter. I missed born my daughter. I missed all my uh, family. family, family, family holidays. Fo uh, family holiday holidays. All time training, training, training. My focus was only this fight. Now I'm happy. Uh, I want to back uh, home, go to my church, pray. I want to say, Jesus, thank you, because for me uh, and uh, my country, it's a uh, big opportunity. Lennox Lewis criticized Tyson Fury's strategy following the British fighter's split decision defeat to Oleksandr Usyk. Fury was boxing like he won the fight. No boxer can judge and say they won the fight. Every time a round was close, they should look at it like a loss. According to Conor McGregor, Tyson Fury shouldn't use his rematch clause in order to face Oleksandr Usyk. Writing on Instagram, McGregor said, A mad hiding. What next? Who knows? Usyk is incredible. 
he has beat both soundly. Whatever moves towards Tyson, AJ, I am for. If Fury wishes to go a second try at the wheel, AJ had two attempts, so why not? Tall ask. Not impossible also. If not, AJ Usyk 3 last hura, and then win-lose or draw go Tyson, AJ. He added, what a time to be alive, thank you to the fighting gods and to God. As the first heavyweight champion since Lennox Lewis in 2000, Uzik's legendary predecessor watched his incredible victory against a fighter nearly three stone heavier and six inches taller. According to his promoter, Alex Krasiuk, the bout ought to have been stopped in the ninth round, meaning his man ought to have won by knockout. I'm exhausted, I was backing Usyk the whole fight. I hope to see more in the rematch, Krasiuk said. No disrespect to the referee, I think he stopped the KO in the ninth. It was a tremendous performance, something unbelievable. Before we go any further into the video, what are your guys' thoughts on the fight itself? Did you have Tyson Fury or Alexander Usyk winning the fight? And will the rematch happen or will Tyson Fury now retire from boxing like everyone is saying? Comment down below. Following the bout, Fury and Usyk were observed chatting in the ring. Additionally, fragments of their post-fight conversation, which contained Fury's holiday suggestion, have recently been depicted. Speaking as he held Usyk's head in his hands, Fury said, Good work, Alexander. You're a strong man and a very good boxer. Very good, my brother. In Christ. The Ukrainian then replied, revealing he had been preparing for the fight since way back, saying, Listen, I started preparing for you when you were boxing in 2008, European champion. A nod to Fury's run as EU junior champion. Junior. Fury then replied, Thank you, my brother. You're a very good boxer. I love it, I love it, good moves. Usyk then responded before the chat was crowded out. I'm very proud, we're a friendly family. My son said, hey, Tyson push you. Fury was then heard proposing a holiday between the two families. He said, I'd like to come to Ukraine with my family and have a holiday with your family and you can come to my house and have a holiday with me. It's great to see the sportsmanship between the pair after the fight, as that's what boxing is all about. That knockdown, did you like the count? Uh, yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah? Are you sure? Yes, of course. Yeah? Congratulations, Thank mate. you, my friend. Congratulations, Thank brother. You. Catch you later. Hopefully, we do get to see the rematch towards the end of the year, as it was an extremely close fight and could have gone either way, no doubt about it. Anyway, this concludes today's video. Be sure to subscribe to Fight Fury for future videos from the combat sports world and turn on that post notification bell so you don't miss out on any future uploads. Until then, see you in the next one.